Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. I am always so happy to have you stop in and visit from time to time. Your support is amazing and it means the world to me. If you are new to my channel, I hope you consider subscribing by hitting that little red subscribe button. I would love to have you come back and join me for future videos. I hope everyone gives this video a thumbs up and to my subscribers, my viewers, thank you again. You, your support just means the world to me. So I have got a Wannable box. And I haven't done too many Wannable boxes, but they have got everything that you need to know right on the cover here to try it out. You send it back, you get five days. Um, I believe you get seven items in your box and you have to keep five to get the discount. There is a $20 styling fee, which is applied to anything that you purchase. And I did get the, um, the holiday edit. So that's a little sticker right there. And the one thing that I do like that I think is cute is that, um, I don't know if I'll be able to hold this up, but they have your name on the sticker. So it's just a, a little added touch. And it's always so heavy. They just kind of put everything and it just kind of comes out like a block. Alrighty. That's what it looks like. Never look this way again. So anyway, this is everything in my bundle so it looks promising I see something furry it uh, doesn't have four legs but it's furry so and let's put this on the floor and then try to open this up so I can show everything and then maybe just try to do a quick try on or I probably won't show everything I'll just do the try on looks like I did get some jewelry in here you get the postage uh, bag to send anything back that you need to exchange or to return. It does come with a USPS thing um, label on it, but you do get an extra label in here if you prefer to go back by UPS. And um, yeah, so let me see what else they have in here. Alrighty, so you get this little grateful tag. I think this was in around the Thanksgiving. So by hitting that little uh, QR code, you it takes you to a playlist. They describe about how to returning it. And on the back of this is the UPS label to return anything. And you do get a stylist note right here. Because you just said it's been a crazy year with some cozy pieces. And I had, you know, they do have that stream, so I'd put some items in the stream. And she was able to grab a few things from it, so excited about that. And my stylist this time is Maggie. And then all the prices of everything here. So you have the, uh, the name of the company and the prices, so... Looks like everything in my box comes to $477. My discount, if I were to keep everything, was $95.40. That brings it down to $381.60. Plus my styling fee credited brings it down to $361.60. So anyway, let's uh, get this going and we'll do a quick try on for you.
Alrighty, so back to reality again. So trying on is always the fun part. And again, there were a few surprises in here for me. So I'm excited to share them with you. And I really look forward to hearing your comments on them as well. So this first item is this V-neck sweater in ruby. It's a size small. You know, and everything in my box was made in China. Just, just saying. Uh, metric. Um, so it's a V-neck sweater, ruby small from metric. It is $69. It is soft. It is comfortable. It's got like these kind of diamond shaped patterns. Sleeve is ribbed all the way. It's got a nice V-neck, but not low at all. The back is just plain. And it is nice. I do like this, and I expected to like it when I saw it, um, taking it out of the box. But it also, it's also $69, which is probably a fair price. But I also know that online there's just so many sales. So for me, $69 for this. Probably not, but I do like the color. I like that it's got the pattern. I, I had it on with those Banks leggings from my uh, Transcend box. So to wear it with that, it would be nice if it was a little bit longer. But I think for wearing this with jeans, whatever, it would be the perfect length. And again, it is really soft. Next, we have these earrings that I didn't try on for you. And I like that the earrings come in these little bags, these pretty little things. Makes for a nice little travel bag. So the earrings are cute. They're like these little hoop earrings. It's right up my alley. But given the choice, if I had was going to wear something like that, I would just pull um, the one I already have with my Swarovski on it. So more than likely, I would just grab this and, and I would never wear those ones. So, But they are right up my alley. If I didn't have ones like this, I would probably keep it. Alrighty, next is a sweater that I could not wait to get off. This is a, an acrylic blend, and which usually doesn't bother me, but this is scratchy. It's itchy and it's scratchy. I tried to get up close to show you that it's got these speckles in it. Some ribbed cuff, and I, I know a lot of this, the acrylic doesn't bother some people, and it usually doesn't bother me. I think it is kind of boxy. I'm not sure if it's going to show up, but it's got like this L right in here. On both sides which kind of kind of gives it a kind of like a drop shoulder kind of look so to me it just kind of looked boxy um, it, I don't think it was flattering on me plus it was itchy and I couldn't wait to get it off so that's gonna be a no this one this surprised me and I don't even know if these are still in style but these are the paper bag ways which I thought was like two summers ago Paper bag waist pants with a self belt and camel. It's from Skies of Blue at $68. I did not expect to like these. Um, I think they're too small for me. Um, I think a small would have been a better fit, but they are so soft. It's like a silky soft, but it's nice. And for me, the reason these are a no, if you haven't guessed it, it's got these nice pockets in the front, a little bit of pleating to kind of give it that full look. There are full pockets in the back, but they are sewn shut. But uh, to me, they're, they're ankle length again, so they're above my ankle. So, yeah, I, I don't understand why pants are so short. I mean, it's not like I'm wicked tall. I mean, I can see if I was like 5'10", 5 5'12", 5 to have trouble finding length on pants. But, you know, I'm, I'm just over 5'3", and yeah. So that's the reason these are going back. I think even if I sized up to a small in these, I think I would still have problem with the length. But if I was shorter or they were longer... They may have, may have been a keeper. Next are these, and I like these just because of the name. They're Phoebe. Phoebe. High-rise boot cut in Astoria Blue. They're from Jag Jeans. They're $89. Um, they're heavier than the ones that I just tried on in Transcend, the page ones. But it was, I'm putting them on, I just kind of felt like, and it sounds kind of silly to say this, but I felt like I was putting on an old friend like a pair of jeans that I'd had for 20 years that still fit and they just it's just that cozy kind of feeling these are actually they're made from recycled plastic bottles so yeah I don't know why, where they get their softness from but anyway um they're high high rise I think they had a really good fit on me the pockets weren't like oversized in the back so I didn't think that was bad it does have some whiskering in the front it's a nice shade of blue. We got the lighter shade on the uh, upper thighs. 
and again the boot cut and they go really nice with uh, the boots and I think I the boots I had on are only like a kitten heel so they're only like an inch and a half and I think that worked good but um, my other boots that I would wear with this are probably like a two inch to, to two and a half inch so I think these are the perfect length and yeah I'm happy with the fit on those so those surprised me because I saw that recyclable thing and I'm like oh those are going to be awful they're going to be crispy and hard to wear um but anyway for 89 dollars and i like the name fibby so this one um i was keeping it on because i was trying to decide if i liked it it's 59 dollars it's the yetta top in black size small two to four it's from tart collections which is a really nice brand and although i have like some turtlenecks and things that i've got off amazon for like you know 4.99 and some from walmart i like it because it's got the uh, you know it's just got that little extra here it's got the little puff detail it's got this nice little turtleneck that you can wear up or you can fold it down um, for $59, I think it's high for what it is, but I think it's the quality. But what I was having trouble deciding is I've got, just got that fit again here with things not going under the arm, like the arms, aren't, the sleeves aren't sewn on right. So, and I was thinking, can I live with it? And as I'm looking in the mirror and I can just see it pulling here. I'm, so that was kind of an easy thing. So I was thinking about keeping this one because it is quality. It's a nice brand. It's a, it's a heavier turtleneck than like the ones that you can get. Uh, you know cheaper but looking in my binder here it's just no I, I that pulling thing would drive me crazy this last item oh my gosh this is so soft this is like cuddling up with 20,000 cats this is so nice that this is going to be a hard one for me to say no to but this is the sylvie faux fur bomber jacket in small it's called glacier size small it's 89 dollars by z supply this is so soft and it's machine washable the inside it's got like a it's a lined with like this uh, soft not fleece but maybe like a flannel type material for me I think the small was just too small for me so I think I would have to size up to a medium but I think the pockets here were just in such an awkward place that I don't think a medium is going to do it and if I'm wearing this for a jacket I'm probably going to want to wear put my hands in my pockets at some point and I put my back up put my hands in the pockets here just in such an odd place plus they kind of stuck out too but oh my gosh this is so nice Ugh, this is so soft so anyway I am glad that I put that in my stream and I got to try it on because otherwise I would be thinking about the what ifs I sure should have got that I should have asked for it and and you know maybe this is maybe more for a junior size like a teenager or something like that which you know maybe they got so i think that's maybe what it's more fitted for but this is beautiful i just really really love it so i am really super glad that my stylist sent that to me so now right now it looks like the only thing i'm thinking about keeping is these jeans but i would love to hear your comments on the other items in my box and if you've gotten some of those items and what do you think about them and again everything in my box was 477 dollars my total off if i kept all five well if i kept all of them would be 95 dollars and 40 cents uh the other 20 dollars taken off from my styling fee so it would be 361.60 i think i'm only going to keep those pants for 89 dollars so with my 20 dollars off it would be 69 dollars but i would love to hear your thoughts and uh, again your comments of course are always welcome i love hearing from you and your support it just means everything in the world to me so thank you everyone for watching i hope you go out and have a fantastic day and we will chat again soon Bye bye